Hi, praise be to God. The word of the Lord today is about wisdom and prudence. The book of Proverbs chapter 8 verse 12 says that I wisdom dwell with prudence and find out knowledge and discretion. In the book of Matthew chapter 10 when Jesus was about to send out the 12 disciples, he commanded them to only go to the people of Israel. Matthew chapter 10 verse 5 to 6 says that these 12 Jesus sent out and commanded them saying, do not go into the way of the Gentiles, and do not enter a city of the Samaritans, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. In verse 16 to 17, Jesus says to them that, Behold, I send you out as sheep in the midst of wolves. Therefore be wise as serpents and harmless as doves. But beware of men, for they will deliver you up to councils and scourge you in their synagogues. Notice the wolves Jesus is referring to here are the people of Israel. Not all, but some of them. Out of all the nations on the earth, God had chosen Israel to be his. When Jesus came to this earth, he came to them. But when Jesus was about to send out his disciples among his people, he warned them. He told his disciples to be careful, to be aware of wolves. Going back to verse 17, the word of the Lord says that, But be aware of men, for they will deliver you up to councils and scourge you in their synagogues. So here the Lord is warning them that it's not just the people outside the synagogue who will be against them, it's also the people in the synagogue. The fact that they will be flogged in the synagogue shows that those in charge of the synagogue, the Pharisees and the Sadducees, will be against them. The disciples needed to be wise and prudent when moving about, what places to go to, when to speak and when not to speak. One of the ways they were to be wise and prudent was to allow the Holy Spirit to speak through them. The book of Matthew chapter 10 verse 19, Jesus says to them that, But when they deliver you up, do not worry about how and what you should speak, for it will be given to you in that hour what you should speak. For it is not you who speak, but the Spirit of your Father who speaks in you. In verse 23, he also says to them that, When they persecute you in this city, flee to another.